Today's game is coming to you live from Minneapolis, Craziana. We're at Mucus Asylum Stadium, and the inmates are taking their medication along with their seats, sharpening their knives, and hopefully not listening to the voices in their heads. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Carolina Panthers battle the Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, I was here on the now. You know what have? Are you ready for some MFL action? Am I? I love MILFs. Newtons, I'd like to fuck. He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you halfwit. Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime MILF lingerie girls team. What a zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all. And it's first and ten. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball here, Bricks. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Nice pick up for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that. But she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Nicely done for a first down. First down and one. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Now, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. up 10 yards on that play. Second down the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. 
zone. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. That run is good for nine yards. Third down and, well, good luck. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Well, that's a lovely shake for the punter today. He just put his team in the hole. Nicely done. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, with the brutal hit! And it's first and ten. was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and five. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. Picks up eight yards on a strong run. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? Second down and two. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing and it's first and ten and he picks up about six on the play and that'll be second down and four And he was stuck to him like glue. Third and four. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense couldn't do anything to stop a thrown out good man! You mean aside from bribing the ref? Killing the quarterback? Or actually playing some damage? Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And this guy's like a human 
cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. No, you are the them. And it's first and ten. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And that'll bring up second and one. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And the passing game picking up some steam. A gain of seven there. Third and two. Nicely done. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. No, oh, with a punishing hit. Second down and a lot. footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Third down and the punter is warming up. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I pictured that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. If no return on this punt, the defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Top for the first down. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. A nice. 
Nice run there for eight yards. And timeouts are kind of like condoms, you know, Grim? You got to use them smart if you want to score. Let's see if they did. Second down and two. That's a T-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time. They stumped the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? The teams line up for the second half kickoff deadlocked in a tie game. Bricks, there is nothing worse than a tie game. Uh, I'm going to disagree. I'm going to say a tire iron in your face. Well, that's a good point. <laughs> they need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Sandwich. And it's first and ten. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. And he zings it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. And that'll bring up second and one. And then catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And he gets three yards on that run. Second down and seven. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Well, this should be easy, but 
With kickers, you never know. And goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. in the defender's eyes, hitting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. target more often and it's first and ten a nice run there for eight yards second down and two First down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and six. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made into dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Oh man, he really. Oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and ten. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts 
Six points on the board. The defense can do anything to stop a drone act like Ben. You mean aside from priming the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. And he's held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. was reading him like a book. Like it was reading. Oh, nice hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. Second down and five. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Picks up 10 on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly as overrated, Grim. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. up the first down and it's first and ten oh and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out sure who he was throwing to on that play. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And 
and it's first and ten. up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and nine. game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! 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 <laughs> Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Come on, those are just my balls. Thank, thank for sharing, Bricks. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. <laughs> Sounds like what, Grim? Sounds like the asshole I'm living on. And it's first and ten. Man, what a hit that was! Timeouts aren't just for offense, Grim? Well, they usually are, but sometimes the defense thinks they're helping out in their own special way. Second down and seven. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. The defense is leaving the team with just one timeout. So they better bring the ball back gift-wrapped. Is it time for a ribbon or a ball, Grim? Maybe if they use their last timeout. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double step burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes 
makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stopping time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And Lynn Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're hands, but he sure has a good set of hands. I don't even get how much. And it's for and they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Graham. Well, and the defense, too. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. What? And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you took him. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. Yeah, it got blown to shit. Speaking of blow, where'd my little mile? They'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. First and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. That he did. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The Colts walk away in victors today. Yeah, except for that one guy down the field with his head knocked off. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that defeated teams should get a participation award because yeah, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard and shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scotch, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Okay. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.